python multiple inheritance in case of multiple inheritance will be having multiple base classes and one derived class and the derived class will be deriving properties that is the methods variables from the base classes and here we are having one example class base one having one statement pass class base two having one statement pass here and class multi derived which will take this base one and base two as the base classes or the super classes and we'll have only one statement pass here so if i can execute this one you see there is no error has occurred so python supports multiple inheritance so let us go for another example here so here we are having a class base one which is having only one method that is a function base one these are the required print statement to be executed and here we are having class base two only one function that is a function base two and here this thing will get executed and base 3 we are having only one function inside it there is a function base 3 and respective the print statement is there mentioned now here we are having there is a multi derived base 1 comma base 2 comma base 3 so here we are having multiple base classes and only one derived class the name of the derived class is multi derived and we are having three base classes base 1 base 2 and base 3 so here we are having only one uh, function there is a function multi derived and where this uh, function multi derived is executing this string will get printed by the print method so now let us go for let us go for our object declaration under this multi derived so md1 is the object name so multi derived uh, object under the class multi derived so we have called this multi derived constructor and this object has got defined and instantiated now md1 dot function base 1 so that means this particular function is getting called and then function base 2 this function is being called function base 3 this function has been called as they are the base classes to this derived class so their respective functions that is the uh, member functions will get inherited into this multi derived as a result of that this multi derived class object from this multi derived class object if i want to access those functions i shall be allowed to access that one and also i can access that very function which is defined itself within this multi derived class so now let us go for the execution you can find that function base one is executing so this function has got its successful execution function base two is executing function base three is executing and function multi derived is executing that means the respective all the four functions they have executed and respective print statements are printing their respective uh, strings to be printed so in this way in this example we have demonstrated how to uh, define one um, uh, one class where we will be having multiple base classes and how to implement multiple inheritance in python thanks for watching this video